Hi everyone, this is my group members. In this video, I will talk about fry and fingerling harvesting stages, behavior and progress of the fry and fingerling. Growth performance of the fish in terms of weight and total length. Fry is referring to a recently hatched fish that has reached the stage where its yolk sac has almost disappeared and its swim bladder is operational to the point where the fish can actively feed for itself. The first step of fry harvesting is by submerge one end of the hose into the hatchery. Second, we need to drop low the other end of the hose. Next, we need to suck the pipe and immediately drop it into the bucket. Fourth, using the hose submerged, move it to areas where the fry are. Next, we need to empty the bucket containing the fry and water into the nursery pond slowly. After that, it's about behavior and progress of fry or fingerling. Behavior of the early fry The fry begins vigorously swimming in a fish-like manner for searching for external food items. After finish, the fry must find adequate food to ensure proper development. Fully development of the digestive system completed after 10 to 18 days. For nursing of early fry, all essential was required. For farming conditions, the fry was fed in the incubation or larval rearing tank. Early fry must be fed 3 to 4 hours in a day. Once the early fry has completed their metamorphosis, they become advanced fry. When the fry becomes a fingerling, they are less delicate compared to early fry, but they still need careful nursing. As for the growth performance of the catfish, length with relationships are of significance and an important tool for the assessment of the growth pattern of fish species and the condition in which they grow. Language connections are of centrality as a significant instrument for the appraisal of the development example of fish species and the condition in which they develop. Development increases in both genders are most noteworthy during the principal year, and lengths of somewhere in the range of 200 and 300 mm are achieved. For every week, the length of the catfish will be measured using the measurement tools. The weight also will be measured using the weighing scale after we get the right measurement of the catfish. After taking the measurement, we can clearly see that the catfish does not have the same weight or length. One of the factors is because of the fish feeding. The fry that have enough feed will grow faster than others. When some of them are bigger than others, cannibalism will occur. The cannibalism occurs when the bigger fry eats the smaller fry and that will make it bigger. Summary Culturing fish is not as easy as we thought because we need to take a look in every aspect of fish management in order to gain successful outcomes.